I don't think there's any type of formal protocol that any artist needs to follow to make impactful work. I do think impactful work comes from an authentic place. And to create from authentic places, you may need to be in touch with yourself a little bit. Boys to be is created by Mike Rousset. There were many children raised in the jungle jungle, each one of them special and unique, despite knowing truths they would never speak. Jay was the last boy left in the jungle jungle he called home. All the other boys turned beasts to rumble, tumble, and roam. I don't like it one bit. It's not fair, it seems. When a boy turns beast, does he still have dreams? For every beast that walks the concrete, a boy flies to the skies. The beast awakens, but the boy never dies. Jay spent his remaining nights from the top of his tree, gazing upon the silent stars from which words once fell free. Boys to beast. This is Dreamhouse, my studio. This is the aftermath of a crazy show preparation, but this is where the magic happens. These are some in-progress floral works, you know, just experimenting with materials and thinking about the context of the material and how it could translate into the work. So this is all Kool-Aid, the wash in the background. I collect plates, man, the plates that I use to make the big painting. I think I started yeah, to save them since I've been here. We've been here five years, yeah. so. Five years of plates. Five years of plates. Craziness. This is actually one of the first mass paintings I did. It's another one. It's another one of the first ones. A lot of the mass paintings were meant to be viewed as containers of like those, that emotion or like that mass that carries whatever complexity of feeling and spirit. But it took, you know, I knew it meant something for me, but I just didn't know. It just took time to kind of like discover it, you know, what they, they really meant. The show has been in preparation for about seven years. It's full idea. So like, this is a seven, eight year project. You know what I'm saying? The exhibition started with the book, Boys to Beats, Act One, No Soul Left Behind. It's about the changing of form. And within like my work, it comes up and in, in is communicated in different forms. The flowers are communicating the moment, the process of the moment and the beauty of the moment. The faces are communicating the emotional complexities of dealing with life. The alphabet is communicating the systems around the communication, around the emotional complexities of life. As I started to go deeper into it, it really was me thinking about a story that is worthy to anchor a narrative of a show. If they really knew me, if they really knew me, they would know I was with the kids at the churro spot. <laughs> but it's all curated. I've been doing art since I was 12 years old. I'm 32 years old, that's 20 years. More than half of that, I wasn't getting paid for anything. I just loved it. I didn't really know how much it took to get it to this point. How much of yourself you have to really give. No soul left behind. That's what it's about. It's the sacrifice that it takes to carry yourself from one point to another. <laughs> 